Hey, what's going on? You know who it is. You know what it is. All right, you guys. Peak game. All right. So, it's looking like Oscar De La Hoya and Golden Boy Promotions may go a different direction if a deal can be worked out for Ryan Garcia to face Tank Davis maybe first or second week of December. That seems to be the targeted date or time frame, whatever you want to call it. But I'll get to that in the next video. But it appears that they could be eyeing a showdown with Tiafimo Lopez the same the same week of December, first or second week, that time frame. And they would want to have this fight at more than likely Madison Square Garden. So it's looking like they would want to have that fight at Madison Square Garden in New York City. That makes a lot of sense. Both of these guys are Hispanic fighters and they figure that they can at least bring out a primarily you know, uh, mass majority of Hispanic fans that would, you know, basically be interested in this fight. And I think it has the ability if promoted right and marketed right. I, I think it has, to, uh, you know, the possibility to sell very well. Will it sell out? That's a question mark. But could you get 12, 13, 14, maybe 15,000, 16? at best in Madison Square Garden, the arena. Yeah, I think it's a possibility. I think it has the chance to be successful. Now, what direction would it go? Would it be is be regular TV or would it be a joint pay-per-view or would it be a joint effort between ESPN and uh, the zone? More than likely, this fight might be a joint uh, pay-per-view, but it would have to be what you would call a more affordable pay-per-view. But me, myself, I think this is a, a, a TV fight. But you never know. You would just have to see. But it would just come down to who's supposed to be the A-side. I mean, me, myself, logically, you would have to say that Lopez is, is the A-side because he has a better resume. But Golden Boy could ruin the fight by hollering about how many Twitter followers Ryan Garcia has. So that could be, you know, that could, you know that could stall the fight from happening. But um, in all likelihood, I think they could get past that. Like I said, if people could put their egos to the side, I think they, the fight could be made. Um, who would I pick in that fight? That would be very uh, interesting because both fighters at times are known to be reckless in periods of fights to where they can set themselves up to get caught with a big shot. So I do think it would be a good fight fan-wise. I don't know who would win, okay? That, to me, would kind of be a 50-50 fight. But who would I favor? Um, uh, <sighs> I don't know. I might would lean a little bit towards Tiafimo Lopez to possibly catch Ryan Garcia later on in the fight and possibly, you know, put himself in a position to stop him. Tiafimo's uh, power is solid. So we would have to see. But I'm interested in that fight if it, if it could happen. So only time will tell. This is your boy, Tail Biz. I'm out.